Yo, what's going on everyone? Shakemake here, and today we are going to be re bringing back the um, Market Watch series, but we're going to revamp it, and this is what we're going to do. I'm going to be showing you guys five players who I really like, and I think their value will go up over this next week. The first one, Kyrie Irving, he came back with a monster game, then he had a pretty disappointing game last night, but I think he's going to have a good week. He's against the Bucks in a couple nights from now, so definitely go get him if you're looking to get some coins, and he's a pretty good player too, so I mean... He's always good to use as well. Another player I think is really good is the next one that I'm going to be showing. These guys that I'm looking at right now are players who could potentially do well, but they're not my top five. I would say that my top five are the ones that I'm actually going to be talking about today. And uh, the next one in particular would have to be DeMarcus Cousins. And DeMarcus Cousins is really, he's been struggling. And as you see, his value dipped pretty low. It's at around 11,000. Right now it's at 14,000, which is a steal get him right now he's had a couple monster games and he's looking to be turning up on the right path so definitely get him next clay thompson as you can see he's been doing well for a while now but he has really picked it up as of late scoring 20 points a couple like three four games in a row and he's racking up assists now too he's had like five to six assists in the last few games so go get him he will provide brandon knight is also another one of these five that i really think you should go get he has really been stacking up the nice 20 and 5 performances. He's putting really good games in, and uh, as you can see, his value is going up. I would really suggest buying him at 13,000. He could probably max it at around 16 ish. So I'd suggest taking a look at him, and he's a good player too. He's got a nice three point shot. And then the last player is a bronze player because I don't want to just talk about the big guys, but I like this bronze player. I like what I've seen from him, and he's really cheap. It's CJ Miles, and uh. I don't know. I, I I like what I've seen from him. He's obviously on a nice uprising trend right now. He's played a couple nice games. They got Kyrie back. I think that's really going to help him get some better looks. And as you can see, he's already started to do better So in the two games he's back. So uh, try him out. I think he's going to be really a, a pretty decent player. But um, basically what I want to get from this series, I want to choose five players every week that I think will do well. And uh, that's what I did here. I chose CJ Miles, Brandon Knight. Clay Thompson, DeMarcus Cousins, and Kyrie Irving. And I'm going to take those five guys and the cost that they cost. So uh, I'll take that total, and we'll see ne at the end of next week, next Thursday, if that total has gone up for each of them. Who did I get right? Who did I get wrong? And we'll see like that. I think this is easier to keep track of if we just do it on a weekly basis. That's why I wanted to revamp the series and change it up and uh, find players who really... I think we'll do well and get better each week as it goes on. But um, right now, as you saw, I was looking through the, uh, what's it called, the 250 players to try and find a, a, one or two that would stuck out, but there really wasn't. Jameer's been struggling lately. I, I looked at him and I was like, eh. He was doing really well, though, a couple weeks ago, but I, I still like the five I saw. Lin Sandy, a couple nights ago, he had a good game, but I don't trust him with James Harden out. I just don't think he can carry that team, so... Those five guys are the five guys that I recommend for this next week who I, I would buy if I had some coins with. Unfortunately, though, I'm keeping Oopopolis, and uh, I'm not going to be buying players at the moment. But that doesn't mean I can't still recommend players. So many people message me and comment on the market watches still and say, hey, which player should I buy and stuff like that. So I've got no problem helping you guys out and uh, just giving my advice because I think I'm pretty good advice at this. I mean, I've been right plenty of times, so... Uh, Definitely be sure to let me know what you guys thought below. If you have any more questions or players that you'd like to know advice about or anything, let me know in the comment section. And tell me who you guys think will do good over this next week and their value will go up from what it is at right now. But peace out and thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you guys are excited for this Watch series. I know I'm going to get a bunch of these picks right. Peace.